What a crazy day. Whoa, I nearly fell over. Good morning, it is wet hair, Becca Lauren's in the cupboard. Hi, Dean. That's really creepy. Good morning, it is, what did I say, Tuesday? It's Tuesday, it is day four. We are all ready. We got up a little bit later today. We've had a bit more of a chill. We are doing a long day in Central Park exploring. And we're going to get a bagel for breakfast. Lauren's giving me a 20. Ching. Oh my god, are you funding my holiday? Oh, thanks Lauren. I'm wandering around and we're ready to go. You ready to go? Oh, oh, oh. Brendan's doing it down the road, course. Brendan Yuri is so close to us right now, my heart is bursting. Is the safe locked? Cool. So we're ready to go. I'm giving the Donna Sheridan vibes and yeah. Very excited. Do -do 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 -do. So we've just got bagels and I've got coffee. I've got a plain cream cheese bagel and an iced hazelnut coffee. Lauren got bacon cheese, no, bacon egg bagel and orange juice. And it's very busy in there, so we assume that means it's gonna be good. The coffee is good, it's very strong, but it's good. So we're just going to stand on a street corner eating bagels and drinking coffee. I feel like a complete, proper New Yorker, really. And, yeah, and then we're going to head out over to Central Park. So we have managed to get to Central Park, which is here behind Lauren's head. Uh, behind me here is the Plaza Hotel, which is from the film Bride Wars, if you've seen that movie. Uh, I don't know, it's probably famous for other things as well, but that's why I know it. And so we're just sat here for a second and we've got a list of all the places we want to tick off in Central Park. So we're literally going to have a Central Park day, really. And then we are going to MoMA later. Yeah. So yeah, so we're just going to chill here for a second before tackling the two and a half mile long park. It's a lot of walking, but it'll be worth it. Just like a, to escape the hustle and bustle of the city, I suppose. Even though there are huge buildings just all around, like here. And there. there you go. And yeah, so let's. I'll meet. I'll see you at our first stop on the list. We're going into the Central Park Zoo. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> Little monkey. Oh, he's so cute. Hi, pal. Come here. Oh, there's another one. Hello. Come back. Hello. Oh, I love them. Baby, come here. No, I'm just gonna annoy them. Oh, I love you. What the hell? It's okay. Move out the way, Lerm. Move out the way. It's okay. I'm not sure what it is. Yeah. 
don't do it. We've left the zoo and we're now walking aimlessly around Central Park. I found the pond. This is our first spot. Lucky bridge. Lots of ducks. So, we've just come across some rocks here and look at the view behind. Awesome. Just tried to take some photos but I can't pose so they all turned out a bit weird. Oh, ah, ow. Now we are going, which way are we going? We're going towards the mall, which when we get there I'll show you, but you'll probably recognise it. It's in a lot of films, so it's like in Enchanted, it's in Gossip Girl. Um, the people always like run or walk down it because it's really pretty. So we're hoping it's this way, but not sure. Um, I can also hear like a band or something, which is really cool. Very American. Um, but yeah, I'll show you. Found the mall. It's cute. Just reminds me of Enchanted. Now does she lay a flower just so he can match your eyes? And the others when the sky is gray. Hey. Just music everywhere, isn't there? I love it. Down. 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 <laughs> oh, there's, there's dogs everywhere. I love it. Bubbles. I really want to go pop that. No. Oh. We've walked right to the end of the mall, which is actually a lot shorter than we have thought it would be. It's so, like, I don't know why. It's because it's in films, everything seems bigger and better, doesn't it? Not that there's anything wrong with it, but we've come to the end and we're approaching a fountain. I can't remember the name of it, but it's the fountain that is also in Enchanted, which makes me happy. shows and then there's like pe people just walk past in this like group of girls and we were like oh, oh it's probably someone famous and freaking Liam from One Direction just walks past I beg your pardon what Liam Payne 15 year old Lauren and I are crying he's literally there I can see him that's not right he's just crossing the road that's bizarre what Yeah, so I'm just like completely confused. He's literally just there. It's 
literally about to get in, a, about to get in a, like a little bike. I can see him, that's freaking weird. Literally. Can you just wave at him? <laughs> oh, I didn't get that on camera, but he just waved at us. There he is. What the frick? There he goes. Bye, Liam. This is crazy. Okay. So in the time since I last vlogged, <laughs> we met him. Literally, he got on the bike thing for about three seconds and then he got off and he was walking back and he met like two girls and then he he saw us and we said hi, got a hug and we got a group, like a group selfie, selfie with him, which I will insert here. So we just met Liam from One Direction. <laughs> turning out significantly more interesting than I ever thought it would be, like, what? Right place at the right time, but that's crazy. Like, we've never just randomly bumped into someone, like, how? Or if we have, it's been someone that's like, like um, Julian Clary on the tube and stuff. Well, like when we saw Michael Keegan Smith and then the kid. Yeah. Michael Keegan Key, but that was here. Keegan Michael Key. Keegan Michael Key. Oh my god, I'm just... And now we're under here. Which, if you watch Gossip Girl, if you watch Gossip Girl, you will recognise. I'm just completely shook. I, I don't even know what to say. That was the weirdest thing I've ever experienced. What? Oh. Right. Anyway. across the pond in which Stuart Little raced in Stuart Little 2, you know, fangirl moment. First Liam Payne, now Stuart Little. Can't quite cope. I'm not sure who's better, but hey. Oh, cool. So this is the, st the lake here, or the pond, sorry. And we're just walking through here, and it's the Alice in Wonderland statue. Oh, I didn't realize they were that close together. This is, this is cool. There it is. So cute. We have found the famous Bow Bridge. It's so cute. I feel super weird being in all these places that I've seen in films. It's just so kind of quite peaceful here. Like watching everybody on their boats. Rather than me. <laughs> you don't want to be rowing your boat down the stream? I've gently, gently. I've had to fall in. <laughs> Capsize. Someone would have to be filming it, be like iconic. Right, I'll film it and you go down there. So we have left Central Park and come to sit outside the Met Museum of Art? No. Yeah. Metropolitan Museum of Art, I think it's called. Um, and then there's a fountain. Hey, yeah, I'm Lauren. Hi. And the steps of the Met are there, which is iconic if you are a Gossip Girl fan like myself. So I just did a photo shoot to channel my inner Serena Vanderwoodson. And yeah, so we're just sat here for a second because my back hurts. And then we're going to go get some food because we haven't eaten in since our bagel this morning. And it's now, what time? Three o'clock? Yeah. Yeah, so. <sighs> In the winds that are, oh, look. Beautiful. <laughs> Here are the steps of the mat, and there it is. Oh, it's gonna not focus. There you go. It's very windy suddenly. Quite nice. Beautiful. You ready to go? Yes. Yeah, I'll show you. It's, just, it's a 
lovely day. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you. There's blue sky, guys. Look. Oh my god. For the first time this entire trip. Today's a good day for us, I think. <laughs> Amazing. Yes, that worked. What? Boomerang. Can you say that? I have. We had our lunch and our drink and a rest, and then we came back into Central Park. And I decided to go on a swing because I haven't been on a swing since I was like 13. So that made me happy. <sighs> I miss being able to go into parks and swing on swings without people looking at you like, God, get out. So, I had to do that. I thought, you know what, screw it, I'm gonna do it. Now we just sat down a second, and we're gonna go find, um, what's it called, Storyfields? Which is what the John Lennon, like, memorial. Um, so yeah. Probably we'll just catch up with you when, when I get there. Oh my God, I'm so tired, suddenly. I just had a coffee and I'm tired. Ugh. Right, I'll catch up with you when we get there. Yes, yeah, well, I'm not the only one. Let me get you then. But I'm not the only one. Na 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 so, a little bit of time has passed. We're on the way to dinner now. <laughs> That's my update for you. I'm going to show you the outside of it when we get there. Because it's pink. Yeah, my breath, my dress. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, so we are back in the hotel, obviously, because we finished dinner, which was really, 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 really good. That place was so, so cute, and it was so nice in there. I've already forgotten what it was called. What was it called? You should have seen a clip just before. Anyway, it was really nice. And then we walked uh, a few blocks and got cookie dough at a place called Best Cookie Dough. And it was literally in this pot. I've eaten most of it. Well, not most of it, I've eaten half of it. I had cookies and cream, cookie dough, and then just chocolate chip cookie dough. Oh my god, it's so good. Hold on. I want some now. Yes, it's literally just cookie dough, as it says. Oh, so good. Mm. So, that's what we did. Now we're back at the hotel, watching some trashy TV. Because we're trying to have a relax, really. Ready for our final full day tomorrow. I don't want to leave. I'm so sad. Like this city is just my favorite place ever. Like I just, I, I loved it before I came and now I love it even more. And yeah, so I'm gonna end the day four, three, whatever day it is, four? Day four? Yes. Anyway, I'm gonna end today's vlog here thank you for watching and i'll see you tomorrow so bye bye bye